How effective is the PTU vent underneath your Ford Edge with this monstrosity attached to it? How much airflow are we getting through this? I have a three-speed fan and this fan blows pretty good. Right here It does a good job on the air. It's three speeds. And this thing can definitely blow air. Now, I'm going to say this is probably 30 mile an hour. Maybe more, I don't know. I can't measure it. But uh, it's blowing a fair amount of air. Now, I'm going to put the cover right up here and try to mimic it being flat and we're going to see how much air flows through these these are just pieces of paper that's all they are and uh, we'll see what kind of airflow we get out of this little nozzle right here directed at the PTU and I'm going to say that it's probably not sufficient uh, let's go ahead and check it out and see if I'm right. I'm on the belief that I will get more out of taking this off and getting rid of it than actually having it on my car. I don't know where their engineering came from. I don't have any stats. I've tried to research it. Nothing. So we're going to go to my unscientific check and we can see for ourselves to what it is actually going to do. And it's is it worth it having it there? Now some say it'll help mileage because it cleans up the air underneath the car but if it's not giving enough air to the PTU what good is it? And uh, I think they put that there as an afterthought uh, personally if they wanted more air they'd have a scoop on there and that's not a scoop so anyway let's go ahead and see what kind of airflow we get out of it Now we'll go ahead and uh, turn the fan on the slowest part and like I said we'll leave it right here at the top hopefully you guys can see the airflow I don't know if you can see it not doing much if you look at it what's going on nothing Maybe if I do this. There you go. Is our car going at that angle? I doubt it. Let's try a higher speed. So, if you're driving around town, you're not getting any airflow. Now we're going a little, little faster. Well, now we got a little bit. Now let me level it out. You can see it. Nothing. Maybe if I tilt it. There you go. We drive our car at this angle, we'll be doing all right. That's not the angle it's at, folks. It's at this angle. Flat. That's how it's running. Nothing. Hardly anything moving. Now let's try it at the fastest speed. Again. We get nothing. We're not getting much air at all going through there. We do this, look at that. But we don't drive our car at that angle. This is basically ineffective. That's my opinion. And my unscientific uh, test is showing us that it's not doing a whole lot. This is really, really fast speeds, but we're still not getting much airflow. But if we tilt it, holy cow, look at that. Now we're going. But we're not driving this way. So, that's where we're at. That's what kind of airflow we're getting. And it ain't much. So, what kind of airflow does that give you? You know? My point, in my aspect, I believed it did not provide sufficient air. 
flow enough in the MPG change I doubt it's going to be enough to even worry about but I can tell you if you drive on salty roads in the wintertime where do you think all that salt's going to end up? in your face when you go to change the oil you're going to end up with a big mess if you live on gravel roads totally useless piece of garbage in my opinion so you know maybe in concept maybe for them to get their EPA numbers up because every little little microscopic mile per gallon they get out of it is what they're aiming for but overall it's not helping your PTU cooling if you can show me where it does I'd be I'd really appreciate it put the comments down below but from what you saw there you're not getting much airflow and the little bit that is coming through you're gonna get a lot more by taking it off because then you got the air eddying and, and swirling up around in the PTU as you're driving down the road and that's really what really counts is the amount of airflow you got so that's my opinion on it folks if you disagree <laughs> down below join Mac T Ford Edge on Facebook we can discuss it all day long whatever you want to do also like subscribe to this video and subscribe to this channel Band of One's always got great music to play. My feet hit the floor today. I'm having a great day. And I want you to have a great day too. And Mercy Girl's got a couple one-liners she's going to toss at you. Thank you for watching Mac T's videos. And remember to like and subscribe. This is a Mercy Girl production.